Welcome back everyone, this is Lamin Sani of LS Web Apps and in today's video we're just gonna have a quick and brief look at the echo and print statement okay so up until now I've been using echo statement to print out stuff so let's just say uh, we have echo um, from the index file okay so back in our browser and I refresh and we have from the index file there's another construct in PHP, a function called print. And print pretty much does the same thing as echo. So you can interchange them as you want. But um, I'll stick with echo because it's more popular among all the scripts that I've been reading. 99% um, of the time people use echo instead of print, um, at least in my case. But um, there's really no difference in using the two. Okay, so you can use them like this or you can pass, um, use them like this as well. So you can use them like a function. But um, just to keep your code clean, I will use it um, the usual way. So when we refresh, you will have the same thing. Likewise, we change echo. Um, it's also used as a print statement, as you can see. All right, so there's one um, very um, important thing that you wanna know about the echo and print statement. So let's say you wanted to concatenate, um, uh, let's say two strings and then print them out. So when you, if you remember from previous videos, I did say put a dot between them and let's say and another string. Okay, so we go back to our browser, refresh, and that will work. But there's a shorthand um, for the echo statement that will help you a lot. So you can just put a comma of separated values, and when you go back here, refresh, um, it will print them out. It will automatically concatenate. Um, these values for you and then print them by concatenate. I mean combine. Okay, so that's it guys There's um really not much difference between these two and um, As usual, thanks for watching. I will see you soon in another video. Cheers. Bye. Bye